So who am I speaking with? My name is Ben Parr. I am the co-editor of Mashable.com, the social media blog. All right, Ben, you have written an insane volume about social media. So let me ask you, do you have any tips specifically on how to use social media when looking for specifically a tech job? The thing about social media is that it allows you to spread your voice. So the number one piece of advice I give to anyone is to use it to build a brand and to build a presence. Because if you think about it, if two people have the same qualifications, but one has 20,000 followers and people reading his or her blog, that person's going to get hired. So use social media to build out your brand, build out your presence, and take it out of the hands of, jo of the people who are doing the hiring. Make yourself a brand that people want to have. So like, have you seen any really good examples of just that? I mean, I've seen people who've gotten jobs through Twitter, through Facebook, through that kind of thing. I mean, um, example, uh, Julia, not Julia Allison, I'm trying to remember, Julia Roy, she has a huge presence on social media. She leveraged that to become the social media head of Coach. And that type of thing happens all the time because she has a large presence, others have a large presence, and they use that to leverage to get a job, to change jobs, to do all that type of thing. But, you know, a lot of people would say, you know, it's so much work to just make a social media presence. I'm a developer. I don't want a social media presence. I mean, is there another way to go about it or an easier way to go about it? There, I mean, you have to, one, do what you love or do what you want to do. If you just want to only program, then only program. But if you are, like to write some and you like to write about programming, there are programmers that have done a great job doing that and spreading their name. You've got to do a little bit of work on the branding side because that's just how the world works today. But just if you write about stuff that you love or um, talk about stuff that you love on video or whatever way, it's going to build up and you're not going to think of it as work, you're going to think of it as fun. Excellent. Hey, Ben, thank you so much. And by the way, what website should you go to? Oh, thank you very much. Or what? Oh, dice.com and mashable.com. I would, it's not a radio show. I don't need you to go listen to, you know, K101. Mashable.com. That's what I wanted you to say. Hey, thanks a lot, Ben. Thank you very much.